guys, how's it going? Lee John Blackmore here, Super Easy Guitar. This week we're doing Lagrange by ZZ Top. Super old track, super great track, and uh, there's plenty of uh, versions on YouTube, but I thought I'd do a version on the acoustic just to show the kind of subtle differences, all right? So let's get straight into it. So that first little intro, you'll hear them playing on the record. You'll hear them playing with their fingers, and if I'm gonna do that on the electric, You can actually hold your pick, if you're clever about it, you can practice it and you can just put your pick in there and then that leaves your second and third finger. So I'm using my thumb on that low E string, oh, sorry, lower A, the fifth string, and I'm just barring the fifth chord here, A. And then when you want to get into the heavy bit, you can just bring that pick back in, all right? Okay, if you want to go back to the fingers, just tuck it back in. So that's a, a little technique you can use. You don't, you know, you can use different fingers or whatever, or you can just use the pick like me. Okay, so I'm playing this A chord, it's A minor. Bass around an A minor pentatonic, you know, because it's blues rock at the end of the day. And what I'm playing in the beginning, okay, I'm hitting, I'm playing the A string, and I'm borrowing my first finger over the D and G in the second fret, and I'm doing a little upstroke and covering the two strings. And along with it, I'm just Resting my palm down and muting to just close it down. Otherwise, it would sound, you know, it'd all ring out. You can do it with this hand as well. It takes a little bit more effort, so it's nice to use a little palm down here. Now, it kind of starts off with this little. So what I'm doing there, I've got my first finger still in this position, the second fret, on the D string, and with my pinky, I'm doing a little bend at the fifth fret, and a pull off. Then going into this kind of, this chord here, and that's my third finger on the fourth fret on the D, and my pinky on the fifth fret on the G. Okay? Try and do that slower. Yeah, you kind of get that because I leave that second finger down there. All right. Then the other if they'll do. That's where they've taken it from. I guess they're big fans, right? Who isn't? So second finger then is going on the, I'm still playing this A obviously, second finger is going on the third fret on the A string, and then the fifth fret on the E string. And at the end I'm doing a, a down up at the end. Again, I hear this with just a little 3 0. So if I do the combination slow, so there's that one. So then it changes key to C. 
play it down here. Probably makes a bit more sense there. So that'll be down, up, up. Okay, C. All right, starts in the uh, eighth fret, just a fifth chord. Then uh, D sharp or E flat, however you want to look at it. Starts in the uh, sixth fret. Then we go F in the eighth fret. Then he kind of solos over that. this kind of stuff yeah just playing the pentatonic in the key of C C minor if you don't know how to play the pentatonic I've got another video on it check it out all right five positions of the pentatonic very very important to uh, to learn especially if you want to improve in your rock and blues all right so yeah he's a uh, so there's a bit of a solo there, and then it goes into this. So that's my second finger on the fifth fret on the D. Then my third finger on, uh, did I say the sixth fret? The fifth fret. And then my second, third finger on the fifth fret. Right, I'll start that again. So then it goes into, so what I'm doing there, my second finger is on the 5th fret on the D string. My 3rd finger is also on the 5th fret on the top E string. And I'm going in between them. Then my 1st finger plays the 4th fret and my 3rd finger stays in the 5th fret. Then my 1st finger goes to the 3rd fret. 3rd finger stays where it is. Back to this A. ACDC do this lick so many times. All right, so this is, um, you wonder where they got it from, right? So uh, A power chord, down, up, all right, down, up. And then I'm playing the third and hammering the fourth fret and coming back out to that A. Stroke on the way out, all right. Down, up, down, hammer on, up. So the count for this one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three. Hope you enjoyed the lesson. Keep the requests coming in, guys. I can't do them all. I'll do my best, okay? I only do a couple of lessons a week. Please subscribe and give me a thumbs up. It really helps me to rank in YouTube, all right? And uh, appreciate the support so much. Keep the questions coming in. Again, I'll do my best to answer them all, and I'll see you the same time next week. Enjoy!